So we have a new film in the Star Wars universe, but I'm not sure that we really needed one. Real cool dude. Yo! What's good, real cool people? It's your boy David, the real cool dude, coming at you with another movie review. Today, we will be reviewing Solo, a Star Wars story. So this film is entirely unnecessary. Though it's unnecessary, it's a whole lot of fun. It really plays like a video game. You have action sequence, a little bit of story leading to the next action sequence, and a little bit of story leading to the next action sequence, and so on and so forth. I give a lot of credit to Alan Alm Einrich, Einrich, the kid, the kid they hired to play Solo. People were wondering if he was gonna be Harrison Ford. The fact of the matter is, in this movie, he's nowhere near that character yet. The story of Han in this movie is when he's pretty much a baby, <laughs> and he's nowhere near the Han Solo that we know and love as he's introduced in the original trilogy. Donald Glover, on the other hand, he was really good, but it almost felt too much like he was a really good impression of Billy D. Williams. Aside from that, the rest of the cast was good. Some of the characters were not memorable, uh, but again, everyone played their part well. They had some solid star power behind these, these characters, and when they were on screen, you connected with them. There's beautiful chemistry between Han, Chewie, and Lando. So anytime the three of them are on screen, it's a good time. And the music, the score, oh, it gave me all my nerdy smiles. It did something like how, say, a James Bond movie does. Anytime there was like a Star Wars-y moment or like a really dope reference, you heard little notes from the original music from the original trilogy. Overall, this movie, though very safe, very one note, uh, very unnecessary, is a whole mess of fun. Every action sequence, you're fully engaged. Good chemistry between the characters. You get to see some new creatures. You get to see some new worlds. It's a lot of fun. Fun is the best word to describe it. Everyone's using that word, and rightfully so. And that's my time, people. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the review. If you did, be sure to hook me up with the likeity like like button. And if you like all the chocolatey goodness, be sure to hit that subscribe button. You can find me on social media at Facebook, Instagram, Twitter at Real Cool Dude, R E E L Cool Dude. Y'all know the deal. Read the thing. As usual, you guys are wonderful, my real cool people. Join me next time, won't you? Once again, it's your boy David, the Real Cool Dude. Keep it real. Hollywood like out here living the dream. I'm the chocolate man who loves silver screens. Giving movie reviews is the thing I do, cause I'm the Real Cool Dude. <laughs>